guys, but when I was in middle school, yeah. even though I had a dad, I would get made fun of for not having my dad because he wasn't with me. Yeah. This system kills our black fathers and then makes fun of us for not having any. Yeah. I don't get that. I'm not going to stand for that. And for all of you here today, no matter where you come from, when you hear or you see injustice, speak the fuck up. Yeah. We're done staying silent. This movement is being led by Gen Z for a reason. We are the end, and this bullshit ends here with us. Now I have a question for everybody in the crowd. When our president said, make America great again, when was it ever great? There's two things that America is quote unquote number one at. Most money spent on the military, which we could eclipse the next 25 countries if they were all combined, and incarceration rates. When were we ever great? My principal says that she stands up for Black Lives Matter. It took one of the students asking his dad to write a two-page letter to her to her make a formal statement. This isn't just in government, it's with everyone. It's in schools, it's with parents. So I ask everyone, whether you're a kid, I mean, remember, I'm 13. So whether you're a kid, a teenager, a parent, please have discussions. Being uncomfortable leads to change, and that's what we want. Yeah.